In the rich environment of African entertainment, the lines of national identity can sometimes be blurred, leading to amusing and often perplexing mix-ups. Ghana and Nigeria, two giants in the African entertainment industry, share geographical proximity and cultural similarities that can sometimes confuse audiences. Welcome to Dropic Media. In today's video, we'll be talking about nine Ghanaian celebrities whose artistry or affiliations have led some to mistakenly believe they are from Nigeria. Before we begin today's video, please like this video to help the channel grow and don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Number one, Julius Ibrahim. With her pan-African appeal and roles in Nollywood, the actress's multicultural heritage and extensive work in Nigeria have led some to mistakenly believe she is Nigerian. Juliette Ibrahim is a Ghanaian actress, film producer, and a singer of Lebanese, Ghanaian, and Liberian descent. She won the Best Actress in a Leading Role Award at the 2010 Ghana Movie Awards for her role in Four Play. She has been referred to as the most beautiful West African woman, according to Ailey Stars magazine. Juliette Ibrahim was born on the 3rd of March 1983 to a Lebanese father and a Ghanaian Liberian mother in Accra. She is the oldest child and has two sisters, including the actress Sonia Ibrahim, and a brother. Juliette and her siblings spent the longest part of their childhood in Lebanon and Ivory Coast due to civil wars. She had a primary education in Lebanon, then proceeded to Ivory Coast for her secondary education, where she lived with her parents. She studied at the Ghana Institute of Languages, where she studied English, French, and Spanish. She also studied marketing, advertising, and public relations at the Ghana Institute of Journalism. Juliet Ibrahim has commented that in Africa, she is not regarded as a black woman because of her skin tone, but outside Africa, she is recognized as being black. She objected to the term half caste and said that she was black and proud of it. She can speak English, French, and Spanish. Number two, M. Anifest. The rapper's unique sound and collaborations with Nigerian artists have sometimes led to confusion about his origins, though he proudly represents Ghana with his music. Kwame Ametepi Tsikata, born 20th November 1982, not professionally as M. Anifest, is a Ghanaian musician, rapper, and record producer. M. Anifest is the son of Ghanaian lawyer and academician Tsatsu Tsikata and Reverend Dr. Priscilla Nana Nketa, a lawyer and pastor. His maternal grandfather, J.H. Kwabena Nketa, was a composer, a professor, and ethnomusicologist. M. Anifes emigrated to the United States in 2001. He currently divides his lifetime between Medina in Ghana and Minneapolis in the United States of America. Number 3. Jackie Apia a darling of both Ghanaian and Nigerian cinema. Jackie's frequent appearances in Hollywood films have blurred lines, causing some fans to assume she is Nigerian. Jackie Appiah, born 5th December 1983, is a Canadian-born Ghanaian actress. For her work as an actress, she has received several awards and nominations including the awards for Best Actress in a Leading Role at the 2010 African Movie Academy Awards and Best Actress in a Supporting Role at the African Movie Academy Awards in 2007. She received two nominations for Best Actress in a Leading Role and Best Upcoming Actress at the African Movie Academy Awards in 2008. Glitz Africa honors her with excellence in Creative Arts Award at Ghana Women of the Year Honors in 2023. She's a movie producer, a fashion model, and a humanitarian. Jackie Apia was born in Toronto, Canada. She's the last of five children. She spent her early childhood in Canada and moved to Ghana with her mother at the age of 10. She's popularly known by her maiden name, Apia. Number 4. Nadia Buari. The actress, known for her roles in both Gollywood and Nollywood, has a fan base in both countries that sometimes forget she hails from Ghana. She was born on the 21st of November 1982. She's a Ghanaian actress. She received two nominations for Best Actress in a Leading Role at the African Movie Academy Awards in 2009. 
Nadia Buari was born in the oil city of Ghana, Sekondi Takoradi, to a Lebanese father and a Ghanaian mother. She graduated with a Bachelor of Fine Arts. Throughout her time at the University of Ghana, she was actively involved in drama and dance clubs. Number five, Yvonne Nelson. As an actress and producer who has worked extensively within Nollywood, Yvonne Nelson's visibility in Nigeria has sparked some confusion about her nationality. Yvonne Nelson, born 12 November 1985, is a Ghanaian actress, a model, film producer, author, and entrepreneur, and a former Miss Ghana contestant. She has starred in several movies, including House of Gold in 2013, Any Other Monday, In April, and Swings, and appeared in the limelight of the movie industry with a role she played in the Princess Tyra and Playboy movies. Yvonne Nelson was born in Accra, Ghana. She is a descent of Defante people. She remains the youngest of three siblings of her parents. Her mother is from Cape Coast in the central region, and her dad comes from Ga, from the greater Accra region, both in Ghana. She started her education at St. Martin the Poorest School in Accra and later went to Agri Memorial Senior High School. She had a tertiary education at Zenith University College and Central University, where she did a degree course in Human Resource Management. She graduated from the Ghana Institute of Management and Public Administration with a master's degree in International Relations and Diplomacy in 2020. Nelson founded the Invo Nelson Glaucoma Foundation in 2010 and create awareness about the disease. As a result of her philanthropic activities, particularly in glaucoma, she was honored by Go Woman magazine and printers for her foundation and theme career. With support from other Ghanaian celebrities, she recorded an all-star charity single and shot a video to help educate people. She also shot a video to help educate people about glaucoma. Number 6. Majid Michel The actor's seamless integration into Nollywood and his widespread popularity in Nigeria have led some to mistakenly identify him as a Nigerian. Majid Michel was born on the 22nd of September 1980. He is a Ghanaian actor, model, television personality, evangelist, and a humanitarian. He received nominations for Best Actor in a Leading Role at the African Movie Academy Awards in 2009, 2010, 2011, 2012, 2014, and 2017. He eventually won the award in 2012 after three previous consecutive nominations. Michel was born in Cantonment, a suburb of the Ghanaian capital, Accra. The son of a Lebanese father and a Ghanaian mother, he grew up in Accra with his nine siblings. He attended St. Teresa's Primary School and later the Infatsinfin School, the alma mater of actor and director Van Vika, and also of former United Nations Secretary General Kofi Annan. In secondary school, Mitchell was actively involved in theatre and was a member of the school's drama club. Number seven, Van Vika. With a significant number of movies in Hollywood and a diverse fan base, Van's identity has occasionally been misconstrued as Nigerian. Joseph Van Vika, born 1st August 1977, better known as Van Vika, is a Ghanaian actor, movie director, and humanitarian. He is the chief executive officer of Sky Plus Orange Production, a film production house. Van Vika received two nominations for Best Actor in a Leading Role and Best Upcoming Actor at the African Movie Academy Awards in 2008. Number 8. Jocelyn Dumas Known for her roles in Ghanaian and Nigerian films, Jocelyn's pan-African appeal has sometimes led to assumptions about her being Nigerian. Jocelyn Dumas, born on the 31st of August 1980, is a Ghanaian television host and actress. In 2014, she starred in A Northern Affair, a role that earned her a Ghana Movie Award and an African Movie Academy Award nomination for Best Actress. Dumas was born in Ghana and spent her early childhood in Accra, Ghana. 
She had a basic education at Morningstar School and proceeded to the Archbishop Potter's Girls High School, where she became the entertainment prefect. Jocelyn furthered her studies in the United States, where she studied to earn a degree in administrative law. Number nine, Peace Eyed. As a media personality and educator who has made significant impacts in both Ghana and Nigeria, Peace Eyed's work, particularly with Forbes Africa, has greatly enhanced her profile in Nigeria, leading some to assume she is Nigerian. Peace Eyed is a British Ghanaian television producer, TV host, creator, journalist, and education activist. She is the creator and executive producer of Netflix's first African reality TV series, Young, Famous and African, as well as the head of digital media and partnership and West African correspondent at Forbes Africa. She is the founder of In Aya Africa, a non-profit focused on improving the quality of education in impoverished communities across Africa. In 2019, she was awarded the African Social Impact Award at the House of Parliament House of Commons in the UK. This marks the end of today's video. If there are any other topics you want us to talk about or any other celebrities you want us to talk about, please let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and share this video and don't forget to also subscribe to this YouTube channel. Peace!